Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Hello. Getting a bike ready to ride. Hmm, tyre still feels a bit flat. Pump it up. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Oh, that's better. Firm and full of air. We'll undo the pump. There. there, and put the cap back on. There. Now, Ted is coming for a ride too. Now, in we go, Ted. Right, now, strap Ted in. There, over the head, and click. Oops, not on yet. And click, there. Now, Ted's got his helmet on, so I better put mine on too. Right, on we go. Right, on and click, there. Now we've got a drink bottle in case I get thirsty. And, ooh, check the bell. That's good. Flick up the stand, and we're ready to ride. <laughs> right, here we go. Oh, hello, Andrew. Hello. <laughs> Another bike. Little Ted is coming for a ride too. Well, off we go. For a ride around play school. <laughs> riding along on a bike in play school. Riding two by two. Riding along on a bike in play school. Ted's are riding too. See the pedals going up and down. Here we are. Wheels on the bike, going round and round. Something else here with wheels. It's the car calendar. Oh, little Ted likes that car calendar. Let's get your helmet off, little Ted. There. Rest it here on the bike and get you out of your seat and into a car. Hey, little Ted loves that car. Better strap him in. Click. There. It's a car with one, two, three, four wheels and a wheel in the boot. It's a spare, just in case little Ted's car gets a flat tire. Oh, something else. In the boot. It's the name of the day. Let's stick it on here. It's Monday. Monday on the car calendar. Brum, 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 brum. Oh, another car here. Come on. Let's go for a drive. Brum, brum. The wheels on the car go round and round, round and round, round and round. Wheels on the car go round and round all the way to town. Brum, 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 brum. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, a horn this time. Got your horns beeping? Beep, beep. The horn on the car goes beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. The horn on the car goes beep, beep, beep all the way to town. Brum, 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 brum. Little Ted wants to go for a drive in his car. Don't you, little Ted? Hip, hip, hooray! The Teddy in the car goes hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! The Teddy in the car goes hip, hip, hooray! All the way to town. Brum, 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 brum. Better park the car. Brum, brum. Let's have another look in that boot. Aha! I thought so. There's a shopping bag in there. Hmm. Some more shopping bags in an animation. Lots of different bags. More bags going shopping. Ooh, 
can smell fresh bread. Warm, freshly baked bread. Straight from the oven. Three breadsticks in a baker's shop. Long and crusty with seeds on the top. Along came a shopper with a dollar one day. Bought a breadstick and took it away. There you go. Thank you. Oh, now, I think I need some fish now. Fish? Yeah. How about the fish shop? Oh, good idea. Now, what sort of fish do I need? Flathead? Brim? Mm. Calamari, maybe. Oh, prawns! Six king prawns in a fresh fish shop. Orange and icy with lemon on the top. Along came a shopper with a dollar one day. Bought some king prawns and took them away. There you go, beautiful prawns. Oh, thank you. Now, what else do I need? Mm. Fruit. Fruit. Mm. How about next door? Oh, well, yeah. do I need bananas or oranges? No, 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 cherries, maybe. Watermelon. Three watermelons in a fresh fruit shop. Pink and sweet green skin on the top. Along came a shopper with a dollar one day. Bought a watermelon and took it away. Oh, oh that's a big Very one. heavy, juicy one, that one. Oh, and a special offer today. Everybody who buys a watermelon gets a crisp, juicy apple. Ooh, yum, delicious. Take one of those, too. Mm. Well... Lots of food. <laughs> There's more food in the story today. But before the story... The clock. What's the time on the hickory dickory clock? Well, the long hand is pointing straight down, so it's half past something. The short hand is halfway between the three and the next number. So it's half past three on the hickory dickory clock. This story is about a dog called Gordon. There's Gordon. <laughs> He's a very scruffy dog. The story is called Gordon's Biscuit. Ella and Sam had a special place for eating biscuits. Almost nobody could find them there. Nobody except Gordon. <laughs> All three in a bath in a tree, eating biscuits. <laughs> Ella and Sam loved Gordon. Gordon had a very good nose. It was black and cold and shiny and could smell biscuits from three blocks away. <gasps> There's a biscuit truck. <laughs> Gordon loved biscuits. Do you like biscuits? Ella and Sam loved biscuits too. Chocolate biscuits, peppermint biscuits, butter biscuits. Gordon loved lumpy, fluffy, crunchy biscuits. It didn't matter what kind they were. Gordon loved biscuits. Gordon also loved the park. There's Gordon in the park. Gordon loved swinging, climbing, jumping, digging, sniffing, and hide and seeking. <laughs> Everyone at the park knew Gordon. But one day, there was a new man at the park who didn't know Gordon. There were new signs everywhere. No dogs. It's the new rule, said the man. Gordon went home and closed his eyes. Oh, he looks very sad. Cheer up, Gordon, said Sam. But Gordon didn't cheer up. 
Gordon stopped visiting the park. Gordon's nose stopped sniffing biscuits from three blocks away. Gordon even stopped visiting Ella and Sam in their special biscuit place. <sighs> Gordon was miserable. I know what would cheer Gordon up, said Ella. Let's make him a surprise biscuit. I know what we could put in it, said Sam. Let's get something special from all his friends. Ella and Sam decided to take Gordon with them. But Gordon, said Sam, you have to keep your eyes closed. The first friend they found was Mrs Periwinkle. Ella whispered in her ear. Aha, twinkled Mrs Periwinkle. I've got cherries and gave them some. Gordon's nose twitched. Jelly beans, winked No Fuss Gus and gave them some. Gordon's nose itched. Strawberry jam, declared Lavinia Davinia. <laughs> Gordon's nose wriggled and squirmed. Gordon has lots of friends. Vicar Victor was partial to crunchy peanut butter. Popcorn, threw in Wheels McCoy. Gordon's nose wriggled and squirmed and itched and sniffed. But he still didn't peek. The Milligan McGilligan suggested lots of things. Gordon's nose sniffed and snuffed and twitched and puffed. But he still didn't peek. Gordon's ears heard squishing and squashing and rolling and poking and thumping and bumping. Gordon's nose danced with exciting sniffs and whiffs. At last he heard, Gordon, come and see. Surprise, cheered his friends. Ah, <gasps> look, a big biscuit <laughs> in the shape of a dog. <laughs> Gordon smiled. It was a very special biscuit. Hmm. And that's the end of the story. Have you ever made a surprise for someone? Or making a big biscuit? Here's the dough. It's all rolled out. Now, a dog-shaped piece of paper. <laughs> Ruff, 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 ruff. To trace around. Put it down. A pastry wheel. It's round. Now, to cut the dough, we go roll it around, around, and cut the dough. There's a head. There's a dog's ear. Another ear. And the back. And the tail. And now the dog's legs. One, and two, and three, and four. Round there. Now, take the paper away and pull out the dough. A little more here. And pull it all out there. And there's... Can you see the shape of the dog? And pull out the dough down here so we can see the legs. A little bit more there. And there. Ruff, 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 ruff. <laughs> now, to decorate the biscuit. Dried fruit. Sultanas for eyes. One, two eyes. How about a cherry? for a nose. There. Now, lots of different fruits all over. Spot, 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 spot. Some more. Spotty, spot, 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 spot. <laughs> there. A bit sticky. Ooh, there. <laughs> a spotty, fruity dog biscuit. Ruff, 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 ruff. Now, to put the biscuit in the oven to bake, here. And 
There, in it goes. Now, the dog biscuit will be ready soon. Here's some more animal-shaped biscuits, already baked. There's a kangaroo here. And a snap, snap, snap crocodile. And a monkey. Ooh, ah, ah, ooh, ooh, ah. Now, I'm going to ice the animals. Some icing here. Now let's do monkey first. How about some spots? Put a spot over here and a spot over there and a spot over here and a spot over there. <laughs> now, crocodile, how about some squiggly lines? Here we go. Put a school whoop doop Squeeze a squiggle over here and a squiggle over there. And a squiggle over here and a squiggle over there. <laughs> Very squiggly. Now, another colour this time for the kangaroo. How about squiggles and spots? Ready? Put a spot over here and a squiggle over there. And a spot over here and a squiggle over there. <laughs> now for some sprinkles. Ready? Monkey first. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. That's green sprinkles. How about some colourful sprinkles on the crocodile? And some more colourful sprinkles on the kangaroo. There. Animals finished. Oh, <laughs> we have a kangaroo. Bounce, bounce, bounce. And a snappy, squiggly crocodile. Snap, 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 snap. And a spotty green monkey. Ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ah, ah. <laughs> The monkey. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, ah, ah. Let me see you do the monkey. Let me see you do the monkey. Let me see you do the monkey. I said. Do the monkey. Snap! 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 Come on, crocodile, this time, snap! Let me see you do the crocodile. Let me see you do the crocodile. Let me see you do the crocodile. I said snap, 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 snap. Do the crocodile. Oh, crocodile is turning into a kangaroo. Oh, bounce, bounce. Come on, you do the kangaroo too. Bounce, bounce. Here we go. Let me see you do the kangaroo. Let me see you do the kangaroo. Let me see you do the kangaroo. I said bounce, 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 bounce. Do the kangaroo. And stop. <laughs> well, it's time to look through the windows now. Wonder which window it will be. Well, it's not the arched window or the square. See a diamond window? It's the round window today. Another Ferris wheel in the play school show. Humpty is the show manager. Step right up, don't be shy. Ride the Ferris wheel way up high. Ooh. Hooray! Well, Lisa, Kim and Jim are keen to have a ride on the Ferris wheel. All right, get your tickets first. Oh, OK. Three of you. Yes, right. thank you. Right. 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 One, two, three. Oh, there you are. thank you. Right, OK, on you go, Jim. Right, here we sit here. Jim, in you go. Open there. All right. In you go, Jim. Put your arm through there, Jim. Put your arm through. So you can hold on. All right, there we go. Now, bar. Keep you safe. Now. Next one aboard, please. All right, Jim. 
In you go, Kim. Ready for a ride on the Ferris wheel. In you go. And close the bar there. All right, next. Lisa. Lisa. <laughs> in we go. Oh, in you go. Lisa. There. Everybody and aboard? I think so. Everyone ready for a ride? Hold on tight, everybody. The ride is about to start. <laughs> Round and round and round we go, spinning and turning, sometimes fast, we some sometimes slow. Round and round and round we go. Oh. All right, everybody. Ride's finished. All right. OK. Off, please. Off we go. Come on, Kim. Out we come. Mind your head as you get All out. All right. Be careful. Oh, that was fun. Now, Lisa. Lisa. Now, out we come. Hooray! And Jim. And Jim. Out we come, Jim. Was that fun? I think it was. Now, another ride? Well, everybody, how about riding on the donkey cart? Donkey cart? Ooh, I think that's Jim's favourite. Well, <coughs> all right, Jim. Oh, hello, Darcy. <coughs> In you go, Jim. Hold on tight. <coughs> hey ho, away we go. Donkey. Riding on a donkey. <coughs> what a great ride. Now you can sit there with Humpty. Now, Kim and Lisa, how about, as a special treat, a big ride on the super slide? Yippee! Hooray! Right up the top. Oh, it's very high. Hold on, and away you go. Whee! Boing! <laughs> That was fun. Let's do it again. Right. Up you go. Climb, 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 climb. Up to the top and slide. Wee! Bounce, bounce, bounce. Wee, 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 wee. All the way to the bottom. Oh, that was very good fun. Kim and Lisa and Jim are feeling a bit peckish. Just the thing up here. How about some fairy floss? There you are. Lisa and Kim and one for Jim. Mmm. Smells good. I'm feeling a bit hungry myself. Oh, mm. That's good because surprise! Oh, oh, Dog that biscuits looks ready. Great, mm. Karen. Mm. Mm. Smells good too. Oh, it is. <laughs> mm. Well, maybe you'd like to have a snack? Or make some rides for your toys. Well, it's time for us to go now. Bye. See you next time. Bye. Mm. <laughs> Of your favourite shows. Look over now to ABC Two. Walking regularly to school is a great way to exercise, but until they are ten, children must always hold an adult's hand when crossing the road. Friday, fifteenth of May is National Walk Safely to School Day. If you can't walk all the way, combine a walk with public transport. If you must use the car, leave it a good distance from school and walk the rest of the way. And remember, active kids are healthy kids. Weeknights. Well, there's been a real baby boom here at Colchester recently. This entertaining series features incredible behind-the-scenes access. Anushka gets camera showing. You'll meet some amazing animals and their dedicated carers. Mixing different animals in the one place isn't without its challenges, but that is what makes it interesting. Life is never dull at the zoo. Hey! Cynthia! Best job in the world ever. <laughs> Seven o'clock weeknights on ABC2. And on ABC One, the Bananas in Pyjamas will be along at 3 o'clock this afternoon to enjoy hunting for chocolate eggs. Coming up next, our education programs begin with Take On Technology.
There you go, flower. Come on, grow for me now. Big and strong. Up to the sky. That's it. Up oh, high. God, oh, hi, Flynn. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Up. No, I've given you lots of water. You're not meant to do that. Oh. Geez, these plants don't look too healthy, Dudley. Oh, Flynn, I know, but I've been watering them enough and there's lots of soil in the pots. Mm, and they should be getting enough sunlight here. Mm, so what's mm. wrong with them? Well, let's see. Plants need water, sunlight and soil to grow. And I've got it. What, Flynn, what? Perhaps the soil isn't healthy enough for them to grow in. So how can I make the soil better? Um, oh, I know one thing you can add to soil to make it better. What's that? Worm poo. Worm poo? Yeah, worms eat food scraps and turn it into worm poo, which plants love. Plants sure do have strange taste, but if that's what they want, then let's get some worms. Hang on, hang on. We'll need to build them a home first. What kind of home? Um, uh, I'm not sure. But we could phone a worm family and find out. A worm family? Sure, there's plenty in the phone book. All right, Flynn, let's do it. OK. <laughs> These are the sort of worms Dodley and Flynn need. They're called composting worms. Their poo, that's so good for gardens, is called castings. Composting worms like to live in covered containers, like this one. And they love food scraps. There. To stay alive, composting worms must keep their skin wet. That's why this worm farm's filled with damp straw, paper and soil. There's a tap at the bottom to let the water drain out so it can be collected. This water's mixed with worm castings so it's good fertiliser to pour around plants. The thousands of worms that live at this huge worm farm get fed more than just food scraps. First, garden waste, like leaves and twigs, is chopped up. Then it's mixed with animal poo in this giant, <laughs> very smelly mixing machine. This stinky stuff is left outside to dry for a few days before it's fed to the worms. Worms like to eat food on the surface, so this machine is spreading a thin layer for the worms to come up and munch on. The bottom of the worm farm is designed so that it can be opened up. The worm castings drop to the ground below where they're collected and put into bags to sell. This worm farm is designed so the worm castings can be easily scraped off the top. The worms burrow down below because they don't like the light. People buy worm castings to use on their gardens and crops. Hmm. I wonder if Dodley's had any luck getting castings for his garden yet. <laughs> 